Well, hello guys, it's Mike from Farming Guys, and today we're in Farm Sim 17 playing on the Gold Crest Valley. That's what the name of the map is. I just have to think about it for a second. So, um, yeah, last episode we were. Let's go with Speed Player here. We just finished fertilizing and we just set up the combine, and we literally just moved the tractor over here. And, uh,. Otherwise, guys, you're completely up to date, so let's go uh, get this thing going. Oh, okay, like that. Okay, and let's start it up. So, um, he's on hired worker, but we're gonna, I'm gonna turn my volume my headset down just in case you can hear me. But we're gonna do a little bit of combining again. We've done quite a bit in the past, and um, the soil beans are over there, so this will be the first time trying to sell beans out, so I'm pretty excited. And we're in the International, Case International, 1660. What a beautiful combine. I actually like this combine. It's a nice combine. For a starting combine, guys, it's really good. So good job, Giants. You finally gave us a decent combine at the start. Oh yeah, so let's back up. I've been testing out the game, guys, off screen a little bit. And uh, found some cool features. And uh, I, I love it. It's cool. I test out animals. I like how you have to pick up your own animals now. Or you have to pay people to bring them. It's great, guys. It's... It's the upgrade we needed. The game's been out for a little while now. Like 15 days only. Wow, that's actually not as long as I thought. But, yeah, still, I'm having fun with the game. But uh, I don't uh, have the, all the time to play this game. So, I play as much as I can. Record for you guys. And then I play on my own uh, map. Which, um, later, guys, I want to show you. I was playing around with a mod, well actually it's like a mod of the Fen 700 series, exactly the same. Just you can change the color, so I gave it uh, like a speed upgrade so the thing can go uh, 120 kilometers an hour. So after this video I'll record that right away. And uh, you guys will see that one soon too. That, uh, that was pretty funny. Especially when it has something behind it. So. I uh, I think I might release it to you guys, and then you guys can go check it out. It's pretty cool. I uh, I'm starting to learn those files a little better, but guys, I'm no modder, so don't expect any mods from me because I can't mod at all. I just play the game for what it is, and that's what we got going here. Yeah, so uh, I just thought I'd play a series and uh, teach you guys some extras about farming that people don't really know, honestly. So, uh, anything you guys want to know about combining? Well, we talk about. I'm gonna talk about how every com how combine really runs around here. So here in real life, here where I live, most places too probably. You um, you combine it, put in a grain buggy. You either put it in uh, grain wagons or transport truck trailer. Like um, you got. I don't know how to explain those grain trailers. Maybe if I remember, I will put a picture of grain trailers. Or you can use transport truck wagons. So uh, or yeah, trailer. So um, then uh, with those, you bring it to the farm. You put it inside the silo, which first you put it, well, I'm not, I've never been a cash crop, but you have to put the shit through a dryer, dryer first too, and then go into the silo, or it's either you go into one of the silos, then go through the dryer and into a different silo, but in real life, you have to dry your crop, in this game you don't, it's pretty easy, you put in a dumper, you drop her off at home. And then you're good. So, 
and then we use the bins, like the big circle bins around here, where most people have those grain elevators and stuff around here. So, um, yeah, this game, they do a good job, but it's not quite the same as real life. Unfortunately, I wish they, um, they put, um, made music so you could actually play in the video so I could turn on the radio, we can listen to some music, but, uh, you will get copyright for that, so I don't need that. Maybe not now because I'm small and my channel is unknown, so maybe they won't see it, but, uh, problem is, once you get bigger, they look at that kind of stuff too, guys, so i never done any uh, copyright stuff, so I'm pretty good. Whoa, guys. It just got bright out. That's nice. This is a nice combine. It's actually pretty modern, this combine. It's not too old, honestly. This combine is uh, actually pretty new, so I don't know. I don't know what that is on the side there. You don't see that switch there? Behind the passenger seat. I don't know what that is exactly. Maybe that's the gear range. That's what it looks like. I'll just say it's gear ranges. Because uh, combines have, uh, yeah, gears. I bet, yeah. Yeah, that's gears for sure. I see N. Barely. Actually, I got a mod. Oh, let's uh, zoom in. Oh, that's funny. Yes, look, there's it's in two and there's three in one. So, yeah, that's cool. Oh, let's, sit, let's go back into the same position. I don't want to be too far ahead. Yeah, I'm using um, what's it called? Um, mod. It's uh. I don't know. Player camera mod or something like that. So that mod is uh, pretty good. We're only 50% full of canola. We need to make some more money because we only have 29,000. But uh, yeah, we did some missions not too long ago. But uh, yeah. I don't want to bore you guys too much with this combining. If we combine the whole time, I don't want to make the video all about combine we'll try to do something else hopefully because the video gets a little boring if we're just combine the whole time so uh i hope you guys have been enjoying the episode so far this will be episode five i believe five i believe so uh hopefully you're enjoying them because uh yeah if you guys enjoy them like and I'll make more. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. So. So. That's how it goes around here. What else can I talk about? So, why. Do I play this game? Well. The same reason you guys probably would like to play this game. Or if you can't. You yeah. have, and if you do play the game, which yeah, probably you guys do, you guys just check out YouTube videos, and learn things. But I'm not teaching too much right now. There's not too much to teach. I can tell you there's stuff that's real and stuff that's kind of fake in this game. Like, um, well, uh, something I wish they added a sprayer with smaller tires, like with. Uh, wheel road tires because in real life they have those smaller sprayers I don't really care for the big one I'd rather have one that can have the small wheels and not destroy the crops so but that's just a little complaint not a big deal because the sprayer is real life but I said might as well just put the the normal wheels on a tractor if you're using that so whatever that's why we have the skinny tires on the 760 over there. So, yeah. Wait, we're at 70%. I'm going to put this guy on hired worker. I, I bet you guys have had enough with him. But, uh, let's get him to fend here. 
let's go toward him. We have 0.4 hours, guys, and um, if you weren't here last episode, you wouldn't know that uh, this thing every uh, four four hours. I mean, every hour was 8,000 or something. Like it's expansive. The I'm leasing this tractor. I didn't say that. Maybe I should put that part in first. I'm leasing this tractor, and every hour you get on this thing, it costs uh, eight thousand. It's expensive. I got it finally. I finally got my words together, and I just said it. Wow, man. Oh man, it's gonna. Oh yeah, this full path thing. So uh, we'll need two loads, and then we'll be. Maybe we need a bigger dumper. Let's see what the next biggest dumper is. Just for shits and giggles. We're waiting anyways. What do we got? Um, yeah, we got this one. Yeah, they don't give you the small one anymore. Oh, no. We got this one. This one is the better. It's better. Yeah, this one is better. Um... I don't know, this one's not too bad, but that's expensive. I don't know if these ones have any... Yeah, this one, that's not worth it, but they do have a difference. It's just in case you want to know. Then we have some modern trailers, too. We have this one. Then we got the It Runner pack here, which uh, I don't think we have enough horsepower to support It Runner. Uh, that'll be uh, too much power. And we got this bad boy here. That'd be a good one, I think, for a little later. Yeah, no, well, that's fine. Well, now, uh, and uh, here's the buggies that you'd use. These ones are usually not quite as big, but around here, and they're, they look a little different around here, but, um, yeah, that's what you basically use in the field. And, um,. Yeah, and this is a European thing as these things. This is has to be used on the manure spreader in Europe. That that's a European thing. They don't, we don't have that in Canada if you're in Europe. We don't have that here. We don't have to worry about that one. Like you guys. I say rough. You have to uh be careful. You can't uh spread shit open but I guess I understand it's a small place and I think we only have oh we have three tractors yes we got this tractor poof I thought we only had two tractors for a second that wouldn't have been good but we got the Ford here New Holland Ford New Holland this says New Holland you can't read it. It's too dirty. But I know what's a new haul. It says right on the steering wheel, too. Oh, man. Dirty. Maybe we should buy a pressure washer. But we're going to get cultivating. Get going. And then uh, we have to put our first plant. And then we do fertilizing again. That's all this game is about. And then, um, speed of time. Hopefully, get a great demand. Make some money. Because we need money. Money to move on. We need some. Because we want to get farther. We don't want to just be stuck at this stage forever. Pretty much, uh, I want bigger equipment. I don't want to lease everything, guys. Because I know if I lease all of the equipment, it'll get expensive. But we're only leasing one tractor right now. Tractor. Tractor. Right now. And that's the fence, which uh, I guess is not a cheap choice. But uh, I wasn't really looking for a cheap choice. I was just aiming for that tractor. And then I just decided, hey, let's lease it. And now we got the 716. We could have got a bigger tractor, but I think that would have been a little overkill for the operation. But I can tell you guys how much it cost to per day on that thing. Per hour I use it. Per day it has cost to, uh, let's see. Per day it's 1640 8020 per operating cost. Yikes. That might get a little too expensive, but we, I'll find out. But, uh, that's something later to know. We'll see. Um, what else? What do we need? 
like, we might want to invest in one of these bad boys. A weeder. They do the same thing as a freaking sprayer, but they're free. What? Yeah. I want to get into cows and modded tether, probably. We'll use. That's a good tether, actually. Um, you know what's weird? These uh, blades don't work for me. I can't get them to work at all. Like, I really don't know what's wrong. But, whatever. And then in a second, we'll get the case on the planner. But, uh, I want to buy, um, next. Let's see what we're going to buy next. Let's, uh, for now, just to keep us moving. I'm going to hire him and just look in here. Next, I think we should buy maybe a new cultivator or planner. Let's see what the next uh, cultivator needs in horsepower. We got, uh, not the base model, but that one. This one is like a touch wider. It's one meter wider. Well, it's a quarter bigger. Um, How much horsepower do you need for that? 120. Whoa. 120? 160. Ha, ha, ha. 200. I don't know if that's legit. Like, these numbers are crazy. Maybe we need to invest into a bigger tractor before we get a cultivator. Well, do we have a plow? I don't know. Do they give us a plow? We need to do some plowing. Guys, that's what we should invest in. But uh, we need to look at these plows, kind of. Uh, this one, was, yeah, that's probably small. That's, um, that's only two meters, which, that's a four furrow, I believe. Uh, I don't know, maybe. Uh, how much horsepower? 180. We have to get one of these two. We'll probably go for the coon, just because it can turn. And that is a four furrow. I think, yes. The the other one's four for O two. Dang it. Yeah, they're the exact same size. It's just the other one is a bit cheaper and it requires less horsepower. What is the better choice? Actually, I just realized let's stop. I'm gonna plow my fields, guys. Get my heel a bit. We want to make more money. Why are we doing this? We want to go plow. I'm an idiot. But that was a waste of time. So let's just put this thing back and uh, let's. How much horsepower is our case tractor? I want to know that. Our big case. Our big case is 145. 145. 145 can handle a good plow. Let's see. I don't know. I think they're the exact same size. Unless this is this one. I don't know. I really don't know what to get. I don't know. This uh, this one doesn't flip. This one does. You know what? For $2,000 more, we can get this one. And I'm going to do it. Okay. Let's go. Yep. Okay, let's go. Ah, uh, the combine will be fine. Actually, the combine's on its last row. So, no, nah, second last row. We'll get going. We'll get notification from him. Let's just uh, lift the loader up a little bit. So, our loader tried to big tires. Big tires on this bad boy. Let's take the fork off of this thing, like so, and let's go. Okay, perfect. Four ways on, and we're off. Forty-three kilometers an hour. Da 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 da. I thought we'd do a little poof, but now we're in the combine because the combine is full. So, oh, we poofed. I made news for you guys. You don't have to watch the boringness of this stuff. So we just poofed over here. We're going to put this guy right on higher. And then we're going to go back to the case. And, but you'll see me at the store in a second. Pretty much. So 
We're just switching the fields. That's all we're doing. And let's go. You're 62% full. You can make it up and down, I think. Huh, huh, huh. Okay, see you when we're at the store. Welcome back. We're at the store. Let's just wait for this person to get out of the way. We're at the store. Let's go get our plow. Four furrow. Let's see what we can get done. We're four furrow plow. Let's make some money. We need the money. But that's good. Our fields need fields need plowing. So we're gonna get our plowing. I don't think this one can fold up actually. Let's see. Have fun. Huh. Yeah, this one doesn't fold. That's cool. Neat. It's not big enough. It's only four for a mat. So be honest, why would it fold? It's not that big. Uh. Oh, well, we're gonna be plowing any second. Like, snap. Well, let's get plowing. This case is a nice case. Why are you plowing with the loader on? Come on, take it off. Mike. No, I'm just kidding, guys. Uh, someone I know. Mikey doesn't like the loader being on, so I just kind of made fun of him there. You guys might not like it either, though. Whoa, this world. I wonder how he's doing over there. Guys, I think I really want to tell you an interesting story. Coming soon, hopefully, maybe. Um. If you guys have ever heard of uh, the video, um, eight-year-old doing donuts, please tell me, because um, let's just say uh, I got a good story about that. A really good story. You guys don't know what it is, and you guys will find out. You think I should tell you? Comment down below. It helps a lot. I will tell you exactly all I know about it and I don't know too much about it but I know a little more than everyone else so I think I want to share that with you guys and hopefully you guys want to hear it because uh, I think that might excite you some big youtubers addressed it the video got popular and I remember the video back when it wasn't popular because, um, yeah, I know something about it because, um, I seen it on Facebook when it first came out back in 2008 and, uh, I am excited to talk about it. So, I just want to say that I'm not going to say too much in this video. Because I kind of want to keep this video separate from that story. So if I tell that story now, then I can't tell in a separate video. So I guess I'll just get that conversation. Yeah, so now we should be getting better with the plow here. Uh, let's see, needs plowing. Let's see, that's good. It's just disappearing. Very slowly, but nicely. Okay, so what we're going to do here, that combine is full, and we're going to go unload them, and it looks like we're running out of time, we're at half an hour, that's all this video is going to be, is half an hour, because uh, I've recorded another video for Farm Sim, to make you guys interested, and I think I'm going to maybe record that uh, episode, uh, the story tonight too now, thinking about it, I have time, and I really would love to tell you guys about it. So we're going to unhire him, we're going to go unload, and then we're going to finish up. I'm literally not going to do anything. I'm literally going to, guys, I'm literally just going to go to um, end this video, edit this video, make the next video in the other map I have, and I'm going to make uh, maybe another video, and then I'm going to relax tonight. Maybe I will play on my my own game where I don't have to uh, show you guys that game guys my own game has like uh, more than like 50 million 
So, if you guys want to know how to add money to the game without getting the money mod, I can also tell you that later too. But uh, that's on YouTube all over the place. But uh, I use it quite a bit. I, I learned it back in when 2013 was a thing. So we're gonna just unload this, unload it from the fan then, and then we're gonna end the video. The video is not actually 30 minutes yet because uh, there is a few cuts in there, a few minutes long. So this video will only be like 25 minutes, I believe, if uh, I calculate it right in my head. So that's great. So let's, we're just gonna put this back over there. We're not even gonna hire him again because literally this is the end of the video. We're gonna get that plow going for a minute. He can do a few, uh, few rows, but I'm gonna save the game and close right after I'm done with you guys. So I'm gonna go sync, turn around here. We're just gonna close the pipe, put the header down. It doesn't want to go down because we're on the right mode. Okay, I'm gonna turn the four ways off there or beacon. Sorry. Shut him off. Um, the plow will go for a minute. Okay, perfect. I think I tabbed right through the fence, but uh, that's fine. Oh, let's go here. Let's go over there. Empty it. Get this thing out of the way. And then next, the next episode, we can get the case going again, and maybe we can do more plowing on video. But uh, pretty successful video, guys. We're getting some plowing done to. Uh, Get our land up to date again, make it a lot nicer, make more money, get the yields, oh sorry, every YouTuber has been doing that, but I have my Satex so I, I should know what button to use honestly, but whatever, I didn't, alright well I'm not uh, gonna move this thing, I'm done with him, the Fent 716 guys. What do you think? My my favorite tractor, 700 series is my favorite tractor series out of any tractor. And it is because of that cab, that window. Look at that. In real life, it's a little nicer because in the game, I can go in and, and uh, you can't see much up. But in real life, it's just like you can just see everything up there, which... um. Can you guess what that's handy for? Well, if you can't guess, I'll tell you. It's handy for loader work because this is a really good loader tractor. That's what it's most handy for is the loader work. And uh, for lifting stuff up high. Because you can see with other tractors. You just have to bend over and go in an awkward position. And if you have a lot of pain in your back or your neck or something, that's not going to be such ideal for you. So... That's why I like the fence. And I can tell you more things as I go why I like the fence. I think I just tell you little things every week. And then after a while, you will know why I love the fence so much. So I guess that will wrap it up. We're at 31 minutes and 46 seconds on my timer. But which will only be about 20 something seconds for you guys. 29, maybe 30 now. So, I guess I will call an end of the video. I had a lot of fun making this one. And uh, hopefully soon we can start making some money off the fields. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys later. Peace. Come back for the next one.